So the prosecution closed their case by kind of reinstating all of the facts. One, that Karen was intoxicated that night and held out the gun. Two, that she didn't put the gun down when she recognized that it was Philip. She knew that this was not an intruder and she kept the hammer cocked on the gun. But the jury only took two hours to deliberate. And that's when Karen Kelly was found not guilty in the death of Philip Petrus. A lot of people do believe that she did have motive to kill Philip. I mean, not getting along with his kids was a big deal to him. I mean, so much so that he didn't even invite her to his daughter's wedding. Also, he was still married to his ex-wife, Sandra, and many people believe it's possible that Philip told Karen about it that night. When she first walked out of court, a free woman, one reporter asked her, what are you going to do next? And here is her response. What would you have to say to Mr. Petrus's family now? They already know how I feel about Philip. Everybody that knows me would know I would never do such a thing. What are you so, going to do next? Go to Disney World. 